No idea what model we have in here, what specs this are. This was uh, given to us from Microsoft uh, at their launch event for the Surface Pro 4 and the Surface Book and the debut of the two Lumias. So we can learn together what specs are in here. Uh, what I'm the Surface Pro line especially for a while. Uh, I use Surface Pro 3 almost every day at home. I do work, I'm sitting on the couch, just playing with my son, so I'm really excited to see what um, this guy can do. So I've jibber-jabbered a while. Uh, let's go ahead and open it up. And as a side note, we also have the Surface Pro 4 type cover. This is not the one that has a fingerprint sensor. That's another model for about $30 more. Uh, this is going to set you back $129. So we'll unbox this guy afterwards and take a look. All right, so I don't have to cut anything. This has a little handy pull tab, so I am going to pull said tabs. I have one tab pulled. You can count along with me. You can tell I'm the father of a toddler. I'm like, count with me. I'll also do our alphabet while we unbox this. All right, we got that slid off. Oh, I got another pull tab. Ha, 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 all right. And there we have the Surface Pro 4. It's still, still magnesium, but now it is thinner, lighter, faster. That is, well, that is really thin. Um, push it off to the side real fast. So what we're going to have inside of the box. We've got the new Surface Pen that uh, you put a battery in and it lasts for a year. They said, and it's in reasonable, you gotta replace ink, so a lot of touch points, removable tips, uh, and all the rest of the stuff you either loved or just didn't use with the original Surface Pen, but if you're a designer, maybe you're really excited about this. Also now a new magnetic part on the tablet somewhere, this guy will just stick to. Right there, and it'll just stick, and then probably inevitably fall off soon after. Uh, let's push all this stuff off to the side again, and I assume here we've got a power brick. Let's see what this looks like. We have, it's a power brick. It's a brick for power. Uh, looks pretty similar to the last one, but you have a built-in uh, inline USB port and uh, two prongs in, and then the proprietary uh, surface port. Looks exactly the same as uh, the last gens. So there's all that business. Let's push all this off to the side. Let's take a look at the Surface Pro 4. We can try to learn together what specs we have on here, because I don't 